A 17-year-old Owasso High School football player is fighting for his life right now as he battles. His family says finding the right donor to help him is their only focus. NBC 25's Drew Moore spoke with his family today and joins us live in the studio now. Drew? That's right, Stephanie. Logan Turner is a junior at Owasso High School. He's your average high schooler. He plays on the offensive and defensive line and has a part-time job. But just three weeks ago, his life took a turn. He was diagnosed with an aggressive form of leukemia. Now it's putting his life and his family's life on hold as they search for a way to get him healthy again. You don't wake up one day and go, you know, hey, I need to be ready in case my kid has leukemia. Three weeks ago, Troy Turner's son, 17-year-old Logan Turner, was going to class at Owasso High School and holding down a part-time job. Now he's fighting for his life at a Lansing hospital after being diagnosed with leukemia. The leukemia has spread to his brain, so he gets spinal taps twice a week. The family, along with the Red Cross in Owasso, is holding a Be the Match bone marrow drive to help find a bone marrow donor. The family says Logan's future might depend on it. I just said, you know, we'll find a match. The bone marrow would help fight the leukemia in Logan's body. Oh. It's a nightmare. As a, from a parent, it's a nightmare. Logan's classmates and teachers have offered their support and encouragement. They're coming up to see him, some of the kids are. But for Logan and his family, they're hoping someone might be able to give the best gift of all. Because finding a match, they say, could save Logan's or another child's life. We just take each day as a gift. He's going to have to fight this the rest of his life. The bone marrow drive will be held this Tuesday, April 7th. We have that information as well as a link to go to a GoFundMe account community members have set up to help Logan's family pay for some of these unexpected expenses. That's on our website, mynbcnews.com. Stephanie, back to you.